Welcome to Calcoin's educational series. The topic for today is GDP deflator. Now, let's have a look at what is GDP deflator. The GDP deflator is a measure of inflation defined over a specific period. It is the ratio of the value of goods and services produced in an economy in the current period to the value of these goods and services produced in the base year. The base year is the reference period starting from which price rise is calculated. The GDP deflator is a price index which can be used to convert nominal GDP into real GDP. It is called a deflator as it is used to deflate the prices to the base year level. Generally, prices increase with time. Thus, prices need to be deflated to achieve the real GDP. Nominal GDP is the total value of all goods and services produced in an year. It is expressed in monetary terms. The price and quantity both belong to the current year. On the other hand, in the real GDP, the quantity produced is from the current year, while the prices are of the base year. Real GDP adjusts any changes in the prices while nominal GDP does not. So what is the difference between GDP deflator and other measures of inflation? Well, there are indexes other than the GDP deflator that can be used to adjust for inflation. One example of such an index is the consumer price index. However, there is an underlying difference between assumptions of two indexes. Consumer price index assumes that the quantity of the goods produced in the economy remains the same, while the GDP deflator does not include any such assumption. In this sense, GDP deflator is a better measure of price inflation. It accounts for changes in the basket of goods produced as well as the changes in the prices of these goods. CPI fails to include the entire production in the economy. Well, that's all for now. For more such updates, please visit our website and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Till then, stay apprised and invest wise with Calkine, your best guide.